Welcome back everyone. Today I'm here with Ross Benjamin from rbwins.com and we're going to be taking a look at the game between the Cardinals and the Padres. So Ross, I actually read your article about this match and you're pretty adamant about the fact that Tyson Ross is basically an unheralded pitcher. Why do you think that's the case? Uh, if you look at his performance line this season, I don't think a lot of people realize the impressive numbers he's put up, Dex. In 22 starts on the year, this guy has an excellent 2.65 ERA, and only five of those 22 starts have gone over the total. And then you look at his numbers at home at Petco Park, and 11 starts at Petco, an unbelievable 1.89 ERA, and just one of those 11 starts have gone over the total. And keep in mind, those totals at Petco Park, with the Padres hitting, and, and the fact that they're notoriously low in that park, that's even more impressive when you look at just one of the 11 going over the total. All righty, Ross. And the Padres, they've been playing a little poorly this season, and they've been displaying an apathetic and anemic offense. How have they actually been able to stay competitive in spite of all that? Well, their pitching has been absolutely superb, Dex. I mean, you look at, at home especially, opponents are hitting just 216 as, as a team against the Padres at home. And then you look at their bullpen. It's been one of the best in all of baseball, and I don't think a lot of people realize that. The Padres bullpen staff ERA is an excellent 2.62, and they've converted a rare 86.7% of their save opportunities, and that's kept them somewhat competitive. All right, now, I, I was actually checking out the SBR odds page, and bookies right now have the Padres at minus 110 favorites. While the total is found at right around six, um, which bet do you think here we're go is going to give us a better chance of a winning ticket? Well, let's look, take a look at this. You know I like my systems, Dex, and I have a good one here. You're looking at a Padres team that's coming off a 2-0 loss at Atlanta. You're looking at a Cardinals team that on Sunday c comes off a one nothing win over the Cubs. It sets up a very nice money line betting system. Anytime you have a home team on the money line between plus 125 and minus 125, they're coming off a loss of two or less runs, and they're facing an opponent that scored one run or less in their previous game. They've gone 62 and 31. That's 66.7% against the money line over the last five seasons. I'm going to take the San Diego Padres, minus 110 over the Cardinals. All right, man, that sounds like a plan, and it sounds like a, a sure lock on that one. Thank you very much, Ross, and I hope to have you back very soon. Look forward to it. All right, sportsbookreview.com, this is Dax Floyd.